Well, new tonight, we're hearing from the family of missing Kalamazoo doctor Talika Patrick in the wake of some new developments in the case. Patrick has been missing for 15 days now. Today, we learned from her family she received a disturbing phone call before she disappeared. They also tell us in the last 24 hours, police seized her computers and have taken out warrants to look at her emails. Tonight, 24 News 8's Heather Walker spoke with her family members. And Heather, what are they saying about these new developments? Well, Marley, the family says they don't know what happened, but nothing about this is normal. I believe that she, she more than likely knew who the, the caller was, and she seemed to, she seemed to have been uh, afraid of something which I have no idea what it, what it might be, but something was, was said to her that caused her to uh, be somewhat fearful. This is surveillance video of Talika trying to check into the Radisson in downtown Kalamazoo. It's one of the last times she was seen in town. Her parents were too emotional to talk today, so I spoke with her uncle over the phone. I am pretty happy for them to get into her, her computer so that they could at least get some more information, possibly a, a, a lead. The family says right now there are too many unanswered questions, like why she left work to check into a hotel instead of going home, and why she had a friend drop her off at the hotel when she had her car. It would somewhat lead in that direction, that she was probably trying to go to somewhere that she felt was, was, was safe and somewhere that was not at, at home. Talika's uncle tells me over the weekend her parents went to Indiana where a car was found abandoned in a ditch. We, we feel that someone might have uh, picked her up from where her car was, was found, either voluntarily or involuntarily, and taken her somewhere. We, we, but we haven't got a clue, but we felt that someone picked her up and someone knows exactly where she is. Talika would not simply walk off on her on her own for 15 days and not communicate with it with her family another new development today the fbi has posted talika's picture on their website and facebook page meanwhile the kalamazoo county sheriff's office says they will no longer answer questions about the case we of course will keep you updated as this story develops live in studio control heather walker 24-hour news 8.